Hi. Okay, I'm MCP, and this is a recap for uh, Matrix and uh, Matrix variations and advanced contact staff class. Okay, so first of all, uh, we did some uh, things to help prepare people for the Matrix. So there was um, this uh, horizontal snares, like this, and there were. <laughs> Um, there was a, a, another matrix variation, the Mel's, Mel's uh, variation, which goes like this. Take it out here, let it do a Steve, and then put it back in on the other side. And that is a nice, easy form matrix as well. But then having this uh, this takeout showed people that you could do a takeout and then a put back in again. There, taking it out, letting it wrap around your hand, and then it's the easy part, and then they're putting it back in, place it back down on your shoulder, and uh, really try and get the center point behind your shoulder where you're doing that. And then slightly easier than that after that was uh, the prayer matrix, and that's a takeout on uh, this side, and then you put it back in on the other side, so it goes more like a finger. So that looks like that. that's going to build up. And then we did uh, some work on just plainly doing the matrix. And so the, the first half worked on this half. And if you couldn't do that quite properly, you can use this arm to rescue it if it's going off. So if it's going down, you can use that arm to bring it back up. Back again. Um, we did that side and then we did the other side separately. We started from over on this shoulder and hit it across. But when it comes across, you didn't want to uh, have it go right next to your neck. You wanted to touch down at the edge of your sleeve so it's easier to go around your arm. I mean, either you can do that by uh, letting it hit there or you can do it by rolling, which is what I just did. I might add on the first side, this side, you want a short end to come around here so that you have a long end behind you to pull around underneath your arm. So in order to do that, I usually put the center point more close to this side of the neck so when it wraps around, it's short and then it's long in the back. So just do that and then to connect those two up, you want to think really much, you want to think a lot about coming back up to the middle again, not staying lent over for this first side. Come back up to the middle, look over here and try to pull yourself to do the second half of the matrix. There we go. Oh, I'll do it properly. Boom. No warm up matrix. Boom. Oh, great. Uh, and then finally, I think we did one other variation, which is like a, a Steve exit from matrix, Steve exit and entrance. And this sometimes helps people understand how off-center they have to get this first arm. So you start off with your hand in the center, like just doing a normal Steve, but you let it roll a lot to the inside, which is completely wrong for doing a Steve, but completely right for doing this one. Roll to the inside, and then it'll go around into the matrix. And then you can do the similar thing on the other side, a lot easier, let it roll down your arm. <laughs> 